Hey, today Jay and I are going to show you how to do math like an ancient Egyptian. So, first up, multiplication. So what you want to do is take two numbers, let's say 63 and 31. Then you're going to want to make a two-sided column, the left-hand side, let's just call it LHS, and the right-hand side, RHS. Then what you would do is start with the left-hand side and start with 1. And keep doubling that number until you reach a number greater than your left-hand number, in our case, 63. So Patrick's going to get to the number 64 and stop. Then on the right-hand side, we're going to take the right-hand number, which is 31, and keep doubling that number until you reach the corresponding number on the left-hand side where you stop. So in our case, he's going to stop on the ninth number, 64. Then, once you have all those numbers in, what you want to do is add up the left-hand side in a way where it adds up to your left-hand number, 63. So for us, it's going to be 1 plus 2 plus 4 plus 8 plus 16 plus 32, which adds up to 63. Then take the corresponding numbers on the right-hand side and add those numbers up, which is going to give you your answer. So you're going to want to take 61, 32, 124, 248, 496, and 992 and add all those numbers up. And you're going to get 1,983, which is your answer when you multiply 63 and 31. So another way to do math like an Egyptian is to do division. And much like our multiplication division, theirs was very closely related. So let's pick two numbers that we can divide right off the top of our head, like 696 and 29. And we'll make another two-hand column approach with the left-hand side and right-hand side. And this time, um, we're going to start with our right-hand side and start with the number we're dividing by, 29. So we start with 29, and we keep on doubling until we get to a number larger than our divisor, 696. So Jay is going to do this, and it'll probably end up being much greater than 696 when he stops, which is fine. Awesome. Now, now we hop over to the left-hand side, and starting with 1, we're going to double it just as many times as we doubled the number on our right-hand side. In this case, it's going to be six times. So then we take, um, well, we look at our right-hand side and see what two numbers add up to make our divisor, 696, uh, 232, and 464. Once we add those up, we'll get 696. So we hop over to the left-hand side and take the corresponding numbers on that column, 8 and 16, add them together, and we get 24, which is the answer that we get when we divide 696 by 29. You can check it on the calculator. It works. So. Uh, Hope you learned how to do a multiplication division a little bit different way. And it like works. an Egyptian? Yes, like an Egyptian. And it's, it's something that they do in some parts of the world today still. So, hope you learned something. Thanks.